Hi, welcome back. Today, it is Tuesday. We are here to do some of our Blue Hegarty book and it is week 19. So if you are joining us for the first time, welcome. If you've been with us every day to do your sound work, that is fantastic. Welcome back. Okay, let's get started. Today, instead of doing our letters, we are going to just do a little riddle to practice a few of our letter sounds. So if you watched last week, you saw me do the Five Little Ducks um, songs. That's what I'm going to do again. Okay, are you ready? Here we go. Five little ducks went out to play over the hills and far away. Mama Duck called, eh, 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 but only the letter who came back. E came back. So you have to listen to what sound Mama Duck is calling and tell me which letter would come back. Ready? Five little ducks went out to play over the hills and far away. Mama Duck called qu qu qu, but only the letter who came back. Q came back, right? Because Q says qu. Good. That was a tricky one. I'll do one more. Five little ducks went out to play Oops, <laughs> over the hills and far away. Mama duck called, x, 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 but only the letter X came back. Did you guess right? Good job. Kiss your brain, go. All right, here we go. Remember, yesterday I gave you a rhyme chunk of the word and you had to listen to a couple of my examples and then try to think of a few more words that rhymed all on your own. And it doesn't matter if they're real words or nonsense words, okay? Here we go. So today's rhyme is uck. So listen to the word, the words that I can think of that rhyme with uck. So I have duck because that's d uck. I can say luck because that's l uck. I could say truck, like there's a truck outside. Trr uck. Can you think of any more? Hmm. Remember that's to say uck. Good job. Any others? Okay. I thought of one other one. I thought of the word tuck. Like I had to tuck my blanket in. Okay, let's keep moving. Today we're going to do the beginning sound, the first sound activity where I say the word then you say it, then together we say it, and we really say the first sound, okay? So let's start. Say the word us. Good. Now together. Us. Good. Say upper. Together. Upper. <laughs> say unfasten. Together. Unfasten. That's like when you take your seatbelt off, you unfasten it. Say unless. Together. Unless. Say understand. Now together. Understand. Say uphill. Now together. Uphill. Good. What sound did you hear at the beginning? What was the first sound you heard in all of those words? Ah, very good. It was ah uh, in all of those words. Okay. Now remember yesterday, instead of me just giving you chopped up sounds to blend, we use sound boxes. So if you have your sound boxes and you want to do that with me, you can. Otherwise, you can watch as I do them and follow along. Make sure you can see them. Here we go. So our first one is b, a, d. What word would that be? B, a, d. What does that say? Bud. Very good. Like she is my best bud. Okay, listen to these ones. K, uh, b. What word would that make? Cub. Nice. Remember, try to beat me. If you can't, that's okay too. You can listen for when I help you. But if you can, try to say the word before me. Listen to the sounds. Uh, mm. What did I say? Fun. I hope you're having fun. Next one, are you ready? Uh, what's that word? Huff, good. Okay, let's do some more. 
Listen to the sounds. Mm, uh, g. What was that? Mm, uh, g. Says mug. Very good. Next one. R, uh, b. What would that be? R, uh, b. Says rub. My dogs like to get a belly rub. Ready for these sounds? S, uh, n. What does that mean? Sun. Yes. Next one. Listen to the sounds. Y, uh, k. Y, uh, k. What is that? Yuck. Good. Two more. Listen to the sounds. G, uh, sh. G, uh, sh says gush. Good job. Last one, okay? Ready? K, uh, t. What does that make? K, uh, t. Cut. Nice. Okay. Moving on to our next part. Oh, it's time for roller coaster arms. Are your roller coaster arms ready? Alrighty, here we go. Listen to the word, and then we're together going to do our roller coasters for that middle sound. Here we go. Say mud. Now do it with your roller coaster. Mud. Good. Say, oh, excuse me. Say rush. Rush. Say numb. Num. Say tug. Roller coaster. Tug. Say run. Run. Say nut. Nut. Good. Say hum. Uh. Very good. Say fuzz. Uz. Good job. Say cup. K uh. Say bus. B us. What sound was at the top of all of our roller coasters there? Did you hear it? When I came up like this on all of those, what sound was I making? I was saying uh. You're right. Okay, now it's time to chop up some sounds. Are you ready? Chopper hands, tapping hands, or finger stretching. Here we go. Say bun. Chop it. Good. B, uh, n. Say cuff. Chop it. K, uh, f. Say fuss. Chop it. F, uh, s. Say hug. Chop it. Uh, g. Good job. Say mug. Chop it. M, a, g. Say, rug. Chop it. R, a, g. Nice. Say, tub. Chop it. T, a, b. Say, gut. Chop it. G, a, t. Say, mush. Chop it. M, a, sh. Last one. Say, dug. Chop it. D, a, g. Good job. Okay. Oops. Now we're going to do our sound substitution. Oh, here we go. Get your hands ready, okay? You can do it with me, or you can just listen. Say the word bun. Change b to s. What's the word? Sun. Say cuff. Change k to t. What's that word? Tough. Say fuss. Change f to b. What's that word? Bus. Say hug. Change h to m. What's that word? Mug. 
say cup. Change k to p. k. Pup. Very nice. Okay. Next up, we are going to add a sound on. We're going to do phoneme addition, just like when you add in math. Alrighty, are you ready? We're going to add a sound to make a, make a word. Say ut. Add k. What's the word? Cut. Say um. Add g. What's the word? Gum. Say ut. Add h. What's the word? Hut. Say uff. Add p. What's the word? Puff. Say uck. Add d. What's the word? Duck. So good. Okay. Now, instead of adding a sound, we're going to take a sound away. That's phoneme deletion. That's when we delete a sound. We take it off. Are you ready? Okay. Listen up. Say the word tub. If I take away t, what's left? Ub. Say fun. If I take off What's left? Un. Say huff. If I take off what's left? Uff. Good. Say sun. If I take away s, what's left? Un. Say but. If I take off b, what's left? Ut. Good job. Okay. Should we finish with a little bit of cow takes a bow? All right, so we know that the circus came to town. Cow went to go check it out, but there were no seats. But then she found out that the clown had let the boss down. So who decided to offer to help? Cow. Cow offered to help, but it wasn't going very well. Cow was having all kinds of problems. Dropping the pies, dropping the bricks, tricycle not working, trumpet not working, Dropping the juggling balls. Then worst of all, what fell down? Do you remember? Her pants fell down. And we ended with her saying, Am I the biggest fool in town? It's all gone wrong. Brown cow flops down. Now she's the one who wears they, do you remember? Frown. So we knew that cow wasn't feeling so great. Let's listen. I'm sorry I messed up, howls cow. No, wait, the boss shouts. Don't go now. Oh, did you hear that? Did you, knew, did you know I was going to say that word? If you did, it's because you knew it was going to rhyme. Listen. I'm sorry I messed up, howls cow. No, wait, the boss shouts. Don't go now. Now rhymes with cow. Look, though, cow does not look happy. Cow looks pretty upset. And there's the boss coming out to say, don't go. What do you think is going to happen? The boss says, don't go. Remember, it's a circus. Do you think it's okay if, if silly stuff was happening at the circus? Listen, he says. The crowd shouts, wow! Three cheers, bravo! Cow takes a... What do you think? Bow. <gasps> Did you know I was going to say that? Listen one more time. Listen, he says. The crowd shouts, wow! Three cheers, bravo. Cow takes a bow. Check that out. It all ended okay. Cow takes a bow because the audience liked the silliness. It's the circus. And did you hear all those rhyming words? We had so many. So we finished our book, which means tomorrow I'll have a new book ready for us to read, okay? I hope you all have a wonderful day and had fun playing with our sounds, and I will see you back tomorrow for some more, okay? Goodbye.